Eli Roth has managed to carve himself out quite a decent career over the past 15 years or so. After exploding onto the scene with a low-budget Cabin in the Woods horror movie Cabin Fever in 2002, Roth went on to direct and have success with the likes of Hostel and its two sequels, The Green Inferno, and acting in various films too, including Quentin Tarantino's Inglorious Bastards. He has a new film coming out in US theatres and on demand named Clown in the next couple of weeks, and Simon Thompson over on Forbes caught up with him to talk about the film. During the interview, Simon asked the filmmaker if he could ever consider doing a comic book movie for a big studio, and his answer was really rather interesting. That stuff really came my way heavily after Hostel, Hostel Part 2 and Inglorious Bastards, he said. I was the go-to guy for a lot of that stuff. At the time, I just wasn't interested in doing it. I really wanted to follow my own compass and do things like The Man with the Iron Fists and things that I thought were weird and interesting and cool. Now I'm in a place where I've done five movies that I've written, produced and directed. I'm totally open to doing a studio film. It looks like a lot of fun. I've written a number of screenplays that have been produced and I can always go back to the smaller, more personal films like The Green Inferno or Knock Knock, but I'm much more open to doing those bigger films now. I'm in the mix for several different films. So it looks like he's talking to a studio. We don't know which one, uh, whether it'll be a Marvel film or a DC film. Whatever it is, we look forward to see what Eli Roth has in store. Clown opens in US cinemas and on demand from June the 17th.